parallels of virtual machines on Mac just released its 20th versions. I've been testing for a couple of days and there's a question pop up in my mind. Why would anyone want to install Windows on a Mac? And I didn't know the answer, so I did a quick search. Then I found three main reasons. Playing Windows games is the first one. As we all know, Mac is very limited for games and all the big titles for DX11 and DX12 haven't worked on Mac yet. I made a lot of attempts to play games on these virtual machines and here's my real advice for you. Lower your expectation. Don't get me wrong, most of the game are supported but if you expect to get ray tracing, shading effects or running at high FPS, you'll be disappointed. A big title like Battlefield 1 will run at around 50 to 60 FPS at Full HD when all the graphics settings are set at high quality. For me, it's still impressive because this game running through a virtual machine with a bunch of translation to make this happen. And the performance actually improved with this update, so we can hope for a better future. Beside gaming, working is the second reason. So we can both agree that MacBook had a slick design, powerful chip, and great battery. But still, there are major applications are not working on this machine. Based on the recent data, Windows has more than 50% of applications compared to macOS, and most of them fall into engineering, science, and IT. While macOS applications focus more on the creative side, like music productions, video editings, and design. That is where Parallels step in, seamlessly balancing the slick design of your MacBook with the productivity you need to get your work done. So Parallel works just like the normal Windows computer. Just go and download the software you need in x64 version and you are good to go. It also has the coherence mode so you can still use the window applications in the background at the same time working on another applications on macOS. And for developer, Parallel is a great savior when it comes to testing the applications on a window environment. Also, with this new update, developers can get the advantage of the pre-built AI package ready to use as well as some integrations. Make it easier than ever to work. And the thing I always love when using a virtual machine is you get the full control of its parameters. You can easily change in parallel configurations. You can expand things or limiting resort based on your need. And the security risk is very low because you can delete or reset the VM without affecting your Mac. And finally, it is always great to have both worlds in just one computer. Instead of buying another Windows computer, invest your money in one powerful machine that make your workflow consistent. And installing Windows now is much easier compared to a few years ago with Bootcamp. Parallels make it super easy for you to install with just 5 clicks away. And it works just like a single application, open and close very easy. So that is graph for today. If you're interested in this VM, remember to check out Parallel 20 with the code I provide in the comment to get 10% off of your orders. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comments or you can DM me through my Instagram. I'll try my best to assist you. Enjoy Parallels and I'll catch you in the next one.